people, Jorge Vassal signing in one more time. Hope you're having a fantastic day and everything is going your way. Just want to give a very quick update on Stable Swap. Man, today is Tuesday, December 19th, I believe. Getting into this Christmas season. It'll be here before you know it. Hope you guys have, you know, got your holiday shopping. If that's what you're doing, I hope you got that done and you're not out here having to brave the crowds, fighting over a doll. With, with, with wild parents that want to get their children to the toy of their dreams, right? Hopefully you can avoid all that. But anyhow, let's talk about stable. I just said that because I've been out there, man. People are wild. The traffic is crazy. People acting like animals. I mean, it's, 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 it's bananas out here. But anyhow, Stable Swap is doing their thing. I want to give a quick update on Stable Swap because they updated the site as promised. And I got to tell you, this was one of the easiest and most seamless updates that I have seen in crypto. Usually you deal with these platforms, they have a website update and the site is down for a while or they don't tell you ahead of time and you go to log in and weird shit happens or they disable withdrawals. None of that happened. This was easy peasy, lemon squeezy, all right? Shout out to Danny D. He told us ahead of time they were gonna do the update. The update happened. Seamless. I didn't even notice, right? But anyhow, what is Stable Swap? For those that don't know, I'm gonna keep this very quick. Stable Swap is an OTC crypto exchange, right? People can go to Stable Swap and off ramp or on ramp their fiat, meaning buy cryptocurrency from fiat or vice versa, sell their crypto back to fiat. The other thing that they can do is they can send funds to loved ones or whoever they want all over the world, peer to peer, the same way we do using Western Union, Cash App right things of this nature they are partnered with licensed partners in a highly regulated banking industry okay they're primarily working in the philippines right now and they're expanding into other countries with india being next up i believe okay so this is an incredible opportunity where we can be liquidity providers and earn a daily passive income for doing so. We deposit our crypto in stable coins, specifically USDT and USDC, <clears throat> right? We earn a daily profit. We're able to withdraw our profit anytime we have at least $50 of funds accrued. And that's it. At the end of the term, we get our, our crypto back. So you can look at the website here. They told you here, right? Look right there. Powered and by a regulated EMI and VASP company right go look that up see what it means kyc they mentioned that but you do not have to kyc to be a liquidity provider okay you can earn your passive rewards without doing a kyc you could deposit you could withdraw no kyc necessary okay only kyc is for people that are going to be sending funds back and forth that sort of thing because obviously that's required in the banking world but for us that want to be affiliates and earn the passive income or as an affiliate, share your link and earn. We don't have to KYC, okay? So I already told you, fiat to um, crypto easily, you swap it. We're getting returns by providing liquidity and is an affiliate program, right? I'm gonna log into my account here and show you some of this stuff and go ahead and make another withdrawal. But they got their roadmap here. I went through this with one of the co-founders, like I said, Danny D, the electrician, man, shout out to him. If you have not seen my AMA interview with him, look in the description of this video. The link to it is there. Watch that video. We go through Stable Swap. We cover a lot of things and you can make a choice whether or not you want to get involved pretty much by watching that, that AMA, that interview. You get a feel for Stable Swap, what they're doing, who's behind it how it works, all that stuff, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and log into my account, but like I said, if you have not saw that AMA and you're considering getting involved in StableSwap, I will tell you that you may wanna watch that. And just to give you a, a shortcut or a cheat code, one of the things I like about StableSwap is that, first of all, it's not trading, right? Forex trading, crypto trading, arbitrage trading, AI bots, none of that. All that's risky. Even if it's legitimate, which half the time we don't know if it is or isn't, right? But even if we knew that the trader is 100% legitimate, legitimate traders blow accounts all the time. That's just part of the trading world. And we have to accept that. This is providing a service 
Okay, people need to send funds back and forth. People need to off ramp and on ramp their their crypto back to fiat and vice versa. These services exist. Coinbase, right? Cash App, Western Union. Think of it. It's a multi billion dollar industry. This is in that same industry. Okay, and let me come down to the bottom. You see here. They're in partnership with Top One. Look up Top One. See what they do. Who they are. Okay. Just look into it. That's all I could tell you. Now, let me go ahead and log into my account. So, like I said, look those guys up and you'll see that there's legitimate partnerships here at play. And this is not as risky as half of these other opportunities out here. Three quarters, even 90 percent of the opportunities I see people so willing to jump into. OK, and I see other promoters so willing to promote some of the riskiest stuff in the world and they haven't gotten a stable swap. To me, they're crazy. OK, but everybody do what you want to each own to each his own. Look on my screen right here. You see, you can use USDT, Tether or USDC. That is the update. It used to have BUSD up there, but with all of the uncertainty, and instability going on with Binance, you know, dude got arrested, the CEO, he had to step down. All these things happen with Binance. People in the community were concerned that the Binance token or coin may start having some issues with their value depreciating and as well as liquidity. Maybe at some point you won't be able to sell it or do anything with it, right? So they're getting ahead of that. So they took BUSD off of the list of stable coins that they accept for those who had deposited BUSD, they went ahead and converted your BUSD into USDT Tether, okay, on the, B, on the Binance Smart Chain, BEP20. So they made that conversion, they took BUSD off of the options, and that's it. But like I said, it was seamless, you went to sleep, you woke up, it was done, the website worked the way it was posted the whole time, withdrawals worked, deposits worked, everything worked. Seamless transition. What more could you ask for in a platform, right? So again, if you're looking at a home screen, people can buy and sell crypto, okay? You got Philippine pesos, some other currencies in there with more to be added going to stable coins, okay? And vice versa. If I go on to transact, an internal transfer, this is where you can send crypto peer-to-peer, -peer, person to person, right? And guess what? They're saying you're even gonna be able to send fiat person to person, right? So it's a lot of different things that this platform's offering and more that are coming, okay? The affiliate side, very lucrative. I'll tell you why. When you register somebody using your affiliate link, they're gonna give you 5% whenever they provide liquidity. So not the first time, but every single time they decide to make a deposit and provide liquidity, you get 5% on your direct referrals, 2% on your indirect, 1% on your third level referrals, right? I bring on Steve, I get 5%. Steve brings on Jim, I get 2% of whatever Jim does. And if Jim brings on Mary, I get 1% of what Mary does as far as providing liquidity. Now, this is where it gets very interesting. On my first level referrals, I'm going to get 10% of their daily profit, okay? On my direct referrals. And you can go as wide as you want. I'm going to get 10% of their daily profit. Let's take a look at that in a calculator real quick. All right. So let's say somebody comes in and they're getting paid 0.35% daily. Okay. Because you can do that. If you go on the, on the highest paying plan, it's going to pay 3.5% every day. Okay. So let's say whatever I put in, let's say somebody puts in $5,000. I'm just making numbers up. Times 0.3%. Hold on, three, five percent. That means they're going to get seventeen dollars and fifty cent a day, which means I'm going to get a dollar seventy five a day. Right. Forever. Or, or as long as they get paid. Right. And that plan pays for three hundred days. That's an extra five hundred and twenty five dollars in my pocket. OK, so now let's just use round numbers. What if whoever I bring on is getting 50 bucks in liquidity? OK. I'm going to get. 10% of that, and that could be for 300 days. Now, what if I did that times 10 people? Not bad, right? Not bad at all.
So you see the potential can be great because you're gonna get the upfront bump whenever somebody provides liquidity. And believe me, some people are gonna do it more than once. They might put $1,000 in today, test it out, feel it out. In a few weeks, they might throw another $5,000 in. You just don't know what's gonna happen, but every time they provide liquidity, you're gonna get an upfront bonus, and every day that they're earning, you're earning 10% of your entire direct team's earnings. That is crazy. Now, when we talk about providing liquidity, you can provide it for as little as 60 days. If you do, you're going to earn 0.1% daily, which is going to be a generated APR of 36.5% at the end of the 60 days you get your stable coins back automatically put right into your wallet. You don't got to not in your wallet, but in your account here, you don't have to request it. It comes right to you. And just so you know, these are straight days. These are not business days. These are straight days that pay seven days a week. At the end of the term, you get your crypto back. You can go to the next term, 120 days or four months. You're going to earn 0.2% daily, right? At the end of the 120, 120 days, you get your funds back and you would have earned a generated profit of 73%. Now, the Mac Daddy plan I went on, I threw 2,000 in and I'm going to throw more in, right? This one is doing 0.35% daily for 300 days, and then that's going to give me 127.75% generated APR. I get all that, and I get my crypto back. And like I said, you can withdraw the whole way through. You're not waiting till the end of the term to make withdrawals. You can make withdrawals whenever you have at least $50 to do so. And you can earn $50 from your daily ROI, as well as from sharing your link with the affiliate plan. As long as you have 50 bucks, you can make a withdrawal, okay? And that is basically it. It doesn't get any easier than that, right? If you wanna get started, all you do is a two-step process. You go transact, right? You wanna to go to deposit. So the first thing you do is you make your deposit USDT or USDC. If you're doing USDT, you could do it using Tron, right? TRC20, ERC20, or BEP20. Any of those are accepted. If you're doing USDC, you could do it on the Ethereum blockchain or the Binance Smart Chain. Those two versions of USDC are available. So you select what you want to deposit. They will give you the deposit address to where to send your funds to. Go ahead and make your deposit. Send your funds to the address that is the appropriate one for the type of crypto you want to send. Make sure you send whatever you want to get here, including fees and so have you for sending on a blockchain, right? Your funds arrive in your account. On your dashboard, you will see what you have available, right? So I have 134 in USDT, five bucks and 80 cent in USDC. Once you have the funds in your dashboard, it may take 10, 15 minutes to arrive. Give it time to travel on the blockchain. Once it hits your account, the last step is just to go provide liquidity. From the home screen, you could press it right there where it says provide liquidity, or you can go to liquidity. When you're on this screen, you're gonna select which one you provide in. 60 days, 120 days, or 300 days. And obviously you can see what each one pays. You hit provide liquidity, select the balance that you want to draw from, right? Whatever you deposit it, type in the amount, hit the box and hit confirm. And that's it, okay? From there, you'll see your portfolio. The liquidity you provided will be showing up there under portfolio. And then every day you will get your, um, funds your rewards deposited to you and you go into history right and then you could see your rewards history right there every day as it's coming in like clockwork all right your transaction history you can see that your withdrawals deposits liquidity if you've provided liquidity affiliate history right you see the your, your five percent bonuses you see your ten percent earnings all that right in here otc history if you sent funds that would be there but that's basically it. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and make a withdrawal and wrap this up. I got 134 in USDT available. Let me go ahead and pull some of that. So I'm going to go to transact. I'm going to go to withdrawal. All right. USDT. That is the one. Let me grab my deposit address. I mean, my address to withdraw that I want them to send it to. Post that in there. 130. 30 bucks is what I'm going to get. I think I had 130 available. I do 130. I'm going to paste in my withdrawal address there and hit submit. I hit in, I put in the USDT 
address. So now it's asking me what blockchain. I'm going ahead and select Tron because that's the one I used. And it tells you right there, withdrawals are verified manually and will be processed in four to six hours. I've made several. It works like clockwork, okay? Everything has been working very well. So I'm going to hit confirm now. All right, so they sent me an email code. I entered that in and my Google two-factor authenticator code. And then that was it. It said withdraw complete, okay? So as you can see, my USDT balance has been reduced by 130 bucks. If I go on my history here, uh, transaction history, I have a pending withdrawal, okay? And that's it. It should hit my wallet. Like I say, 46 hours is the time for them to process it, and then it, it should be on the way, okay? So, man, I got to tell you, StableSwap has exceeded expectations, and it continues to do very well. If you want to get involved, the link to do so is in the description below, okay? If you haven't watched the AMA with me and the electrician man, Danny D, the link to that is in the description below. Check that out, all right? He's a good dude, and he's brought us a fantastic program that's working very well. All right. So if you want to get in link to do so, it's in the description below. I'm going to go do my thing. But I wanted to bring you this update and show you they did update, update the site as promised. He mentioned that in our AMA and it works seamlessly. OK, so no more BUSD as a deposit. You got Tether, you got USDC. They work well. Get in where you fit in. Do what you want to do. If you want to get started, links in the description below. Jorge Vassal signing out. Sending you guys nothing but love and happiness, joy, success, prosperity, wealth and abundance. As always, beautiful people, please do well and be well.